C2 Cryo Balloon Ablation System in service video. Plug in the foot pedal power cord into a standard outlet. Turn on the power to the controller by connecting the foot pedal interconnect cable into the controller. The C2 Cryo Balloon catheter should be inserted into a therapeutic endoscope prior to connecting to the controller. Open the endoscope's biopsy channel cap and insert the C2 cryo balloon catheter with the protective sheath in place into the biopsy channel. Withdraw the protective sheath from the biopsy valve. Advance the catheter through the endoscope until the balloon is visible. Remove the catheter connector cap. Insert the catheter connector into the controller. There will be an audible click. Tug on the catheter to ensure catheter is correctly connected to the controller. Press the Confirm icon to confirm catheter attachment. Insert the round end of the cartridge into the controller cap, pressing firmly. Rotate the controller cap clockwise, twisting firmly until it stops. For standard focal and pair catheters, confirm ablation dosimetry is set to 10 seconds. To inflate the balloon, perform a puff by depressing and quickly releasing the blue ablation pedal. For optimal visualization, position the catheter balloon proximal with the endoscope by pulling back on the catheter shaft, withdrawing the gold band back into the endoscope. During the procedure, hold the controller upright to minimize bending of the catheter shaft. To pinpoint the treatment location, perform a puff by pressing the blue ablation pedal the tissue will momentarily freeze. To adjust the diffuser axial position, select the translate mode by pressing the black mode select button. The foot pedal will display arrows pointing up and down. Use the gray pedals to move the diffuser to the desired axial position. To adjust the diffuser rotational position, depress the black mode select button again. Rotational arrows indicating clockwise and counterclockwise direction will be illuminated. Once the orientation of the diffuser is correctly in place with the target area, you are now ready to perform ablation. To ablate, press and hold the blue ablation pedal. Ablation will automatically stop after desired treatment time is complete. To target the next area for ablation, select the appropriate gray pedal. To visualize the target area, perform another puff. To ablate, Press and hold the blue ablation pedal. The controller will prompt when the cartridge requires exchanging. Remove the cap from the controller, insert a new cartridge, and reattach to the controller. When the procedure is complete, return the diffuser to the most distal position within the balloon. Press and hold the gray deflate button on the foot pedal to deflate the balloon and withdraw the catheter from the scope. Continue to press the gray deflate button while withdrawing the catheter through the scope. Once the catheter is removed from the endoscope, press the eject icon on the control panel. Select the green check mark to confirm ejection of catheter. Disconnect the catheter from the controller. The controller will then ask to confirm. Select the green check mark. This concludes the C2 Cryo Balloon Ablation System in-service video.